is Angie Naylor. I'm a member of the Swill Executive Committee and Chair of the Austerity Action Group, Boot Out Austerity Marches On. It's my privilege to tell you about the origins of this campaign group and of the ongoing support given to us by Swill. There are campaign slogans and there are campaign slogans and this one, emblazoned on my t-shirt, says it all. Boot Out Austerity. It stands to educate the public, to agitate for social change and invigorate and organise a group of social workers. So, rise up, rise up and come with me, we'll march in solidarity. Social workers, one and all, listen to my rallying call. From Birmingham to Liverpool in 2017. We'll march for the rights of those who can't fight without austerity. That call brought social workers out from underneath their cloaks of in invisibility to stand shoulder to shoulder and side by side with service users to challenge the government's austerity policies that were unfairly impacting on those who could least afford it nor fight back. Social workers are by the very nature of their profession campaigners and activists for social justice and through their professional association BASWA and more recently their union SWU have a strong track record of influencing social policy through lobbying and responding to white papers alongside being invited to take part in government working parties. Whilst taking to the streets and marching in a block has been commonplace with some associations and unions, the same cannot be said of the social work profession. Of course we've played our part signing petitions and marching in demos, but usually as concerned citizens or under one of the many other alliances we subscribe to, because we all wear many hats. That's not to say social workers as a group have never protested, of course they have. Way back in 1973, as part of the Cuts Can Kill campaign, the then chair of Baswa, Kay Richards, led a delegation of West Midlands social workers along the West Brom High Street. And more recently, in 2014, as part of the Britain Needs a Pay Rise campaign, the then General Secretary, Bridget Lobb, headed up their campaign. And it was here that Baswa and the newly formed SWOO's names first appeared on a protest banner. Social workers were no longer invisible and new alliances were made. And then came the Swazua banner. Swazua? Social workers and service users against austerity. The social work profession could now rally round and be seen standing under a banner which proudly displayed the badges of a number of key service user groups, flanked by the logos of Baswa and SWOO. We could proudly march side by side for social justice and against austerity. The groundswell of anger at the government's austerity policies continued to grow. The injustices caused by those measures were most poignantly and accurately captured by the filmmaker Ken Loach in his 2016 film I, Daniel Blake. The film's title became both a watchword and a call to action. To stand up, stand up for the Daniel Blakes who the DWP did close their gates. Social workers, one and all, listened to my rallying call. And we listened and we acted when in April 2017, the then chair of Baswa Guy Shannon called upon social workers to walk in the spirit of the general marches from Birmingham to Liverpool to highlight the devastating effects and boot out austerity. Well, that walk had a big impact, included on the walkers themselves, who were determined to continue campaigning against austerity and for social justice. And that was in 2017. And still we march on through the Austerity Action Group, which for the last two years has been funded by SWU as part of its ongoing commitment to boot out austerity. Whilst COVID-19 pandemic may have prevented the group from physically putting our boots on the ground, We've continued to stamp our measures across all the social media platforms, educating, agitating and organising as we go. And along the way, like the Jarrow marches before us, we will sing in protest, in solidarity and sometimes as we did on the march for our supper. The Austerity Action Group congratulates SWU on reaching its 10th anniversary and thanks it for its support. Boot out austerity!